Welcome to Bon Appetit. Guten Tag, guten oh. Abend. Hola. Ooh. Hi, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> um, this is our special Christmas segment. Holiday. Holiday? Well, of course it's a holiday. Christmas is a holiday. And New Year's. And New Year's, that's right. Right now I'm going to introduce once again my sister-in-law, my favorite friend, my Oh, what a great chef, Tina, known as Christina. And she's going to explain to you a little bit what's happening. But before, don't talk yet. Our sexy, it sexy Abby. Oh, I never forget you. How could anyone forget you? <laughs> this is Ampie again, sous chef. And I'm going to just hand it over to the two of you just to do a bit of explanations of what we're doing. And if I... Okay, so today it's all about keeping it simple. Um, you, you have guests that come here that bring in the holidays, bring in the new year. They don't really want to be in a restaurant. They don't want to be in a bar drinking and driving. So they might want to have a few people here to stay rent the place, the beautiful clubhouse at Sleep 16 is a great place to have a family gathering or friends and, um, and have a few hors d'oeuvres that are not difficult. You don't have to be a genius. So the first one we're going to make is um, salmon, smoked salmon. Very healthy too. <laughs> and, of course, <laughs> and, of course, and of course everything that we're going to make is for the the dog and for her his sidekick, the one with the uh, ape with the apron. with the sorry, the one with the doily is going to be for the sidekicks, and the one without is for the dogs because the dog would eat the doily. So oh, that's, that's, <laughs> that's good. And I would just like to say one thing: we've changed something at Dimension Mum right now. The clubhouse is no longer called the clubhouse. Oh, it's La Grande Cabine. Oh, yeah. And how elegant. Oh, oh yes, exactly. <laughs> boy, boy, and boy. it does, I think you we had mentioned it, but it doesn't sleep 18, it sleeps 16, just to make sure that everyone is comfortable, okay. has enough That's space for me. Enough. Okay, perfect. Okay. okay, so this is how simple it is. You just buy sandwich bread and it can be whole wheat or white. I prefer whole wheat. Oh, healthier. And of you just take off the crust mm -hmm. and then Oh, that's the best part though, the crust. No? I know, we're saving that for the, the birds and the ducks and whatever else. Then you just roll it flat. Okay. Oh, I love the roller. Oh, I know. Pamper chip. <laughs> <laughs> Pamper chip. Oh, I love Pamper chip. And you just slice it in, in the triangle. So then I hand it over to Impato. I'm not working. I'm just enjoying it. <laughs> Actually, there's a bottle of champagne on the side. And voila. You have to wait. <laughs> So for the dog, we use the cream cheese. Plain. Not plain. No, no, plain. Okay. So just <laughs> go. Put it. Not too much, but make sure the uh, the edge. How do you say it so? Edge. So the edges. edges. <laughs> Excuse my español. I mean my English. <laughs> okay. This girl's got a lot of humor. <laughs> then you just put a piece of a small salmon on the middle. Uh, time? No. 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 This deal. Is deal. Deal. Good deal. Good. <laughs> <laughs> deal. <laughs> and you just roll it like this. So easy. Look. Jun, 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 jun. I think it's one of the most elegant ways to serve. It's it voila. Yeah. Dog. Dog. Now we're going to make one for us. Here. For the sidekicks. 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 Oh, oh yeah. Okay. Sidekicks so, so I can we can them. use... <laughs> So this one we can use with herbs and you know onion. to give it a little bit more taste. This um, one actually is light chive and onion. Mm. Mm. Same thing. Can we take do we a piece to taste of this after? salmon? Yes. Mm -hmm. yes, you can. And you can add um, capers or red onions or anything that you would like. Uh, we're just keeping yeah. it simple. But if you like more in there, some people like chopped eggs. Just roll egg. it again. Roll it again. Oh, oh, chopped eggs. Egg. Uh, chop Could you put caviar in there? If you like caviar. <laughs> okay, but not for the dog, of course, because it's too soft. Voila. You see the color? Christmas, holidays. <laughs> so that's as simple it is as it is to make the little salmon rolls. And I'll turn the other one around. Okay, so now let's clean this up and we'll make um, the veggie, the cold vegetable pizza. Perfect. Now, I believe we're doing the second appetizer, correct? Yes. Which we're, is? We're going to make um, a cold veggie pizza. A cold one? Yep. Why isn't it heated? 
Because it's cold. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this okay. Is, this is a great way to get um, fresh veggies into your dog or into your children or into your husband who doesn't like veggies. Okay. <laughs> so um, it's just a it's a fun appetizer. It's it, you know what you you just find that veggie platters are a bit boring at times. Mm -hmm. So this is a, a more fun way. Okay. okay. And, ve and dogs love vegetables. Yes, they do. No onions. <laughs> That's right. That's right. And if you use garlic, not too much of it because too much can be bad. Okay. So all we did was take the Pillsbury crescent rolls. Pillsbury? You didn't make this yourself? I opened the can. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> because okay. you have to remember your guests are on vacation. That's they don't true. want to be making That's true. this is easy. Family fun, and you want them to enjoy the mensa moment. Yes, anybody can make it. <laughs> if I can make it, anybody can. Well, me so too. <laughs> I've, I've we've just baked it, and now we're going to split it for the sidekicks and for the. the uh, no, I'm doing the dog. Oh, you are okay. Yeah, this is a plain. Okay, and I'll do the cream thing. cheese. I just want to. So, I have to put my glasses on. Which one has onions in it? This is my son. Okay. This okay. Is I just want to make sure because we never want to give. No, wait a minute. If that's your side, is that without onions? Oh, I'm doing the doggy. Okay. <laughs> so it's very easy. It's it's just but you see how conscientious that we are. No, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Because you switch sides. No, 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 no. This is the dog. Yeah. Which I'm one has the green dog. beans? I'm doing the, the green beans is right here. Okay, see. Okay. All right. All right. Sorry, 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 sorry. Okay, let's try that again. <laughs> You're doing the dogs this time. I'm doing and the I'm going to do the sidekicks. Okay. And I'm so staying I'm the using way. cream cheese once again with uh, with onions and chives. Mm -hmm. Me playing for the dogs. It seems very easy. Mm -hmm. Oh, it, yeah. it is very easy. Another version of this is uh, Mexican, and you just take the cream cheese and you mix it with the um, taco mix. Oh wow! And then you use black beans and onions and corn um, but and olives and you know anything that you would use for Mexican food but I'm not sure how dogs are with beans so. Oh! oh I guess. <laughs> so, so I thought I'd well, go for the veggie. Well. <laughs> no, I prefer no gas. Thank you. I mean I had eight Bernie's Mountain Dogs here. Can you imagine? <laughs> I thought you said charisma, Christmas. <laughs> That's not charismatic. Oh my gosh. Well. Now you can be so, generous with the cheese. Yeah, I was oh, going to say. Okay. Yeah. So, well, dogs like cheese. Tina, <laughs> Tina and I, coming from Germany, you know, like uh, we like everything a lot. Lots of butter, lots of this and that. And me, my gorgeous. Me too. I. You do too? <laughs> yeah. Do they, uh, do they use a lot of cream cheese in Colombia? To be honest, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Can I ask a question? Sure. Just to clarify, because now we've, we know that this is the human, which has got the chives, this is the other one. Now, I think you've substituted something, which means you've got the onions, but the other one you've substituted and you've put beans in it instead of onions. Dogs I, love green beans. I didn't know and that. That's really good for them. Hmm. My sister has a dog that her vet has instructed her to put beans with every meal. Wow. That's something about the stomach, that. I don't know. But anyway, these beans actually came from my garden. And um, You have a garden? Yep, a small wow. one. Wow. <laughs> so I actually, as soon as they were uh, picked, we blanched them and froze them. Oh, that was my next so, question. Yeah. So that's another question. I noticed the broccoli. Do you give it raw or yep. do you blanch it as well? You can either way. Either way. Either For way. either the sidekick right. or the... Or and the, you can use any veggies. The only one, the only difference is that we have onions for the sidekicks, and we don't ever put onions in for the the dogs ever. Okay. It okay. really causes um, liver damage, so it's it's Ooh. it's bad. Kidney, I think. Oh. I think as well. I'm not yeah. sure about yeah. that, but I think so. So okay. So it, as I said, you can use any toppings. That I you wash like. my tongue. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not touching. <laughs> and Color? it it just Isn't looks it? pretty. You know, it's a uh, mm -hmm. it's festive. Here's a tomato <laughs> for me. And we yeah. have um, today we have zucchini and we've got mushrooms and broccoli and some red peppers and tomatoes and onions on my side and um, beans on my side. Yeah. 
Front your garden. <laughs> <laughs> They're actually quite good. Okay. Mm -hmm. Like that? I have to ask my balls. Okay. <laughs> That's right. And then we just put a, a little um, shred carrots. Oh, which, which dogs absolutely they love. Really do. Actually, so do the sidekicks because mm -hmm. we've got like even from just sat like salad of just carrots. I know. Very European. Yep. And yeah. some cheese. And what of course, type of cheese? Oh, this is just a mixture of cheddar and uh, mozzarella. Okay. Oh, I'm making a mix. Uh, cheddar, is it all mild or is it a stronger cheddar? It's medium. Medium? Yeah. So, and, yeah. and you can add jalapenos or olives or anything you like on a pizza, but it's cold. But not for the sidekick, but no. not for right. the dog. Right. No. So, what are we calling dogs these days? We're not calling them poochies. <laughs> We're not calling them our four-legged friends. Well, they are our best friend. Mm -hmm. We have to think of a great name like the sidekick but for the dog. Not calling the dog. It's too cold. Okay. So, was this finished? Yes. I can get rid of this. So we just cut it into little pieces. Just fun to eat. We can test this after, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, we have to have Absolutely. the approval of our dog. <laughs> yeah. well, of course, well, we're going to be all set up at the dinner table later on beside our nice fireplace. Me? Enjoying all this. I'm going to get out of your way. Yes, for the cardi. Maybe my pieces are too big. But I don't and have your pieces imagine. can be bigger because it's a dog. Oh, <laughs> this is good. I don't think they they uh, will be picky. I think so they'll right, they'll they'll like wolf it thing. down. Yeah. Yeah. So right now down. our second appetizer no. is, so is done. Yes. So yeah. three and three. Let's do it nice and equal. Mm -hmm. um, Rory, could you turn the oven on to like four hundred? Is it so nice? Really yeah. So shall we move this? Yes. So we'll move this. Uh, um, we oh, put it over here. Okay. okay. All, right. All right. Now for number three, we're going to do, we had a request from one of your um, customers to show them how to make pigs in a blanket. What is a pig in a blanket? <laughs> well, it's a little pig <laughs> that is wrapped in a blanket. You know, stay warm for the winter. Now the imp important thing here, this was my challenge, was to make it for a dog, you, I had to read all the packages to make sure there was not onion or onion extra, uh, onion dehydrated onions or onion powder, any onion. Okay. And Schneider's is the only one I found. Really? I, I, I read well, Country it. Naturals. Yeah, you have to read every package just to make sure that you don't want to give your dog any onion. And I know people are always giving their dog hot dogs. They don't. They think it's harmless. That's true. I never even thought of that. No, I don't yeah. give out hot dogs. But I know a lot of people do that for treats. Yeah. So, so you like can't you know. buy the little cocktail. For humans, I usually use a little cocktail sausage. Mm -hmm. It's a little spicier. But if you want to enjoy the holidays with your dog, be careful about the onions. You've okay. done a lot of research into this. <laughs> wow. Yeah. I didn't realize that, that there was only one. So, Schneider's, Schneider's is Germany. Now this is easy, Germany. you just you just buy the puff pastry in the frozen department. Okay. And another tip is pe um, President's Choice has the best puff pastry because it comes flat like this. You're, I'm sure you don't have rolling pins in every um, chalet. No, I and don't. And nobody really wants to be rolling and having to buy flour. Mm -hmm. So you buy the pepperage, I mean the President's Choice, mm -hmm. which already comes flat. Oh, great. Okay. And it's simple, you just slice it in strips. And then you wrap your little hot dogs. So girls. I'm gonna wrap one? <laughs> I've never wrapped a piggy. So no, I think I'll watch you do it first. <laughs> it's really simple. Now you're going to see the experts wrap and you're gonna see somebody who's never wrapped it before. And then you always wanna bake parchment paper, I mean on parchment paper. It never sticks. It's better than putting grease on the on your cookie sheet. And especially with puff pastry, you really want to utilize parchment paper. Okay. okay. Oh, less work as well. This work too. It's it's even when you're baking cookies or anything. Parchment paper is your friend. Okay. Now this is good for at least 
Three, right? Four. Four? <laughs> <laughs> I need a knife, guys. <laughs> oh, I think. Oh, well, it's okay. It's a cabin. I have my own knife. Yes. Watch out. Oh, Birgit is here. Birgit? <laughs> yes. One, two, two three. three. Cut. Cut. Okay. One, two, three. Oh, I thought when I only did one time around. <laughs> no, no. You, I mean. Girls, are you what? ready for a glass of champagne? <laughs> oh, I am. But we should wait, huh? Yeah. Wait till it's the, the hour. Okay. Twelve. We have to, to celebrate. Okay. So one, two, three. Ooh. How come you're not doing any uh, rope? Because I'm the slicer. Oh my goodness. Okay. I just mooked. Mo three. I'm afraid to get around you with your knife. <laughs> You don't trust me. I wonder why. Here we go, but look at a nice straight line. And you know when you think about it, Schneider's when it's all natural and everything, it's better for us as well. Of we course. don't need all those nitrates and all no. that uh, no. stuff that people always complain about going in hot dogs. Oh my goodness. What is it what is it that our friend calls this appetizer? Um toad in a the toad world? in a hole or something? Uh -huh. She Helen couldn't think of um Toad in a hole? I don't I don't know where she gets the toad from. Uh, <laughs> Helen is a little bit strange. <laughs> Maybe you make it. Oh, well, she watches this. Sorry, Helen. <laughs> You're not strange. I love you. <laughs> okay. There we go. This the vocabulary. Hold. Hold. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I understood that. Okay, this is my. This is, there, we, there we go. This is this yours. Is so much fun. Are you putting oh your my. name on yours? Well, I have there two that were like. What do I do with this little dippy thing? Don't nada. Need it. Don't use it. Nada. Okay, I'll put nada. it on. Nada. nada. Bye. <laughs> okay. Oh, One more. What's One happening more. here? It's your your gotta place them gentler, teen. Well, that's the beauty okay. of it. It's you can have your children help you with this. It's fun to. It, it, there's no uh, beauty, you know, like oh, it has to be perfect and. You know, nothing to get crazy nothing about. Perfection. But let me tell you, but children and men Look, mm -hmm. love this. This is one of their biggest appetizers. Are you serious? Yeah. It seems so strange. It's really so Yeah. It's so funny because when I do weddings and things, it's the first thing that, Look, that goes. Look, you're the one who mushed it up. Well, it, see, it, it got a little... I hope so, I just hope to tell you, this can happen to you too. <laughs> if I... I have more. I have more. Okay. Just a second. I think we've got enough here, don't you think? Yeah. 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 So we now what do we do? So we put, put it in a hot oven. The oven's okay. Out. Yes, I think you told me to put it at 400. Mm -hmm. 400. Uh, so middle we, rack. Yes. Okay, I have to mention good. something. Uh, cooking times are different because I've got gas here, and I believe um, what is it? Uh, le, nor, uh, what is it? Uh, that oven? That that new one? That convection. Thank convection. you. <laughs> convection oven. It's not it, really that new. But it. <laughs> I never had one. I am still in, I'm gas, but they say the best chefs in the world use gas. Oh, gas? No, I like convection. Well, I will use gas yeah. and you will use convection, but you're the chef. It's not All right. convection, it's convection. Okay. Okay, that's it. Cut. Hi there. Again, well, our wiener, wiener's in a pee. <laughs> Our pigs in the blanket are still in the oven. They are nearly ready. In the meantime, we will be doing liver pate, the easy version. Um, there are several ways you can make liver pate, but normally you have to cook it, and then it has to chill for several hours, and you have to put clarified butter on top to seal it. So remember, we're on vacation. We want to do it something simple and easy and fun. So, and once again, you have to read your labels. It's very difficult to find liver pate for a dog. This one does not have onions or any kind of onion um, dehydrated or anything. This one does. <laughs> I'm blind too. <laughs> All right. So and this one does. So this one will save for the sidekicks. And this is really uh, just a made-up recipe that my mother made when my parents had a restaurant in North Carolina and she used Braunschweiger. I can't I couldn't find Braunschweiger here. I don't know if they have it in Canada. But Braunschweiger is very popular in the States. Would you like a yeah. pair of scissors? 
Maybe so, because this knife is awful. <laughs> I have to sharpen them. <laughs> See, this Always is my kitchen. <laughs> no, and I don't cook. That's why she's the cook. She's the chef. So it's just the liver and cream cheese. Same spoon and cream cheese? Well, it's, yeah. it's all going in the same place. <laughs> okay. Because <laughs> we're going to use it all. We're not going to use all of it. So. So. You can use a real blender too. But, <laughs> but it's just as simple as that. And I'm going to hand this over to Ricardo. Okay. I know and the I dogs are going to love this. Well, you can be generous. Dogs love this stuff. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then this one. This is actually what Braunschweiger comes like in a tube like this. I don't know why I couldn't find it here. What oh, isn't, that, isn't that a European? Isn't that a European uh, label? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. I think you can get that in other parts of um, of Canada. Oh, okay. I don't think probably Winnipeg or someplace. I think Ontario as well. I'm, oh, I'm not sure. I'm just, yeah, because there's a lot of products. Uh, there's so a if lot you're, of Germans. So yeah. if you're coming from other parts of Quebec, uh, from other parts of Canada, bring your brown schweiger. <laughs> <laughs> oh, do you put that much on it too? No. Yeah. The dogs love. Yeah. It. Okay. The dogs. Yeah. But you know what? I had somebody who was saying to me, I'm a little bit too skimpy when I do things. I should put more cheese and more of this. And now I see the love. It so. Is that skimpy or cheap? <laughs> <laughs> That's skimpy. <laughs> Frugal. So voila. Can I make another? That's fine. Okay. Yeah, we've got four of those. We have four. Four. Mm -hmm. Four. Four dogs. for two dogs. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> so. I am really making a mess here. Let me clean your hands for you, girl. Okay, we just have to stir it up a little bit. And yeah, this one's coming along. Would you like another dish for that? No, I'm going to put it in a little pot there. Um, because you put the chime? since the sidekicks have hands, they can they can uh, fix their own. <laughs> well, that's good. Now, is this the last time you have to do it? Yes. That means we can open up the champagne pretty soon? <laughs> yes. I have to check the piggies. Piggies. Yes. Check the piggies. Oh. oh. They smell good, don't they? Mm. They do. It's such an old appetizer, but it's such a winner. Okay, so to finish it up, we just add some chopped chives. Just, you know, because we like it. <laughs> we like it. And um, the, the liver pate that I bought has um, onions and different vegetables in there. So it's, it's a little bit more... Um, more flavorful. More flavorful. really all there is to it. So if you like a little liver and some cream cheese, <laughs> that doesn't work very well. <laughs> have to change brands. have to go to the, a new blender. Um, but this is really good. My mother used to serve this uh, for the people that brought their own alcohol because it was a dry county. So the uh, restaurants couldn't sell their drinks. So when they brought their own alcohol, Mm -hmm. And my mom would serve this at the table and it would just be gobbled up. Mm. I've never tasted that before. It's good, huh? <laughs> and yeah. voila! Simple. Wow. Okay. <laughs> so, so, all I right. Can put a little bit of uh, parsley. Well, maybe you should check since you you know you like also. those piggies just right. <laughs> you could just check it to see. A little bit for the dogs. Uh, parsley, it's good for them too. They love it, and you de decorate. Look, everything is one. <laughs> Holidays. That's right. Mm -hmm. And a little touch. And uh, during our commercial, <laughs> our commercial, <laughs> you um, you talked about putting cayenne 
yes. on our pizza, and I oh. thought that was a great idea. Yeah, and actually, we, we cheated. We already tasted, <laughs> and they're absolutely exquisite. But really, put on cayenne pepper or just anything you want on your own, the sidekick. Not for you. I wash my piggies. Okay. <laughs> Uh, I don't know. It's I hard to see. Okay, do you want me to take them out? Yes. Yeah. yeah, because the... There we go. Here, she must be up. Yeah. Oh, they look good. Yeah, they look good. Okay. So, do we need the oven anymore? Nope. Nope. Oh, Mr. Santa Claus on the oven? No, okay. he's, he's not man. a Santa Claus. <laughs> what is he? He's a clown. He's a no, snowman. No, no. But he's dressed up like a clown. No, we are in Canada. Oh, <laughs> that's me again. What can I tell you? Hi, Mr. Snowman. <laughs> so, uh, so we're gonna take this over. Pinza, pinza. La pinza is the hand. <laughs> La pinza is the hands. I got one. Wow. Oh, we have oh, one. We have good. one version. We have two versions, and I'm just holding it. That looks really good. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. I'm so hungry. <laughs> but I'm so. Oh, I know the champagne. I know it's waiting. I'm gonna pop it pretty soon and start us girls on celebrating. Yeah, we too. Huh? And we started course, a long time ago. Of course, you can serve these with a little ketchup. If you have children, or mm -hmm. some people like it with a little mustard. I think that's, this. I think that's, that's wonderful. wonderful. So, those are two easy but wow. festive looking appetizers. And I think that uh, anybody would enjoy that, including the dogs. <laughs> including them, of course. So now it comes to the time that we've all been waiting for. Yay. We've been working, slaving. Is it? Well, no, no, we haven't even been slaving, actually, because as it's Tina easy. mentioned, this is so easy. You can do this, you can enjoy your evening, you can go out on the trails, you can enjoy outside. And then you come in and you enjoy eating and we are going to pop. It's a lot of fun. Ah, yes. Ooh. Ooh. Bubbles. And Bubbles. experts. Oh, well, of course, of course, of course. <laughs> um, champagne is one of my favorite drinks. So, and what we want to show is just once again, we're just going to prop this up. Whoop. This is the final, final version of simple appetizers. They look delicious, they taste delicious. Now don't remember, you can do this at home, or if you would like, you just have to give uh, Tina a call and she'd be more than happy to, to uh, do all this for you and you can just warm it up. No, it's, and as you can see, now, as you can see, I was just about to, to take mousseline away because mousseline went straight for the pizza. And one of her other segments, she went, she went straight, she went straight, what did she go for? The, the meatballs. The, the meatballs. She went for the meatballs. I mean, she this, seems to know there we go, finished. there she goes. Okay, make sure it's the right one though. Um, this one, this Let's yes. See. Yes, yeah. she's got the right one. She's a smart cat. Hey, Muslim. <laughs> How does go. she always know when we're finished? I don't know, but she's always <laughs> she's, there she to taste it. Yes. <laughs> I'm going to take this out of here because that's not the right one. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> so cats like veggies too. Oh, yeah. Muslim is, look at her. I mean, cheese. She says vegetables. She says, why can't you make this for me every day? Why only on special holiday seasons? Look at this. Mussolini, you're going to think that you're, I starve you. Leave some for the doggies. There we go. So, Happy. Yeah, it's me. It's you. Wow. So we wish you all a very, very, very holidays, happy holiday season. And to that, we go. What do you go up? <laughs> oh no! <laughs> and champagne. Oh my oh, goodness, and it's on my glass too. Merry Christmas, happy holidays. Oh, this is a good one. Bye guys. See you later. See you next. Well, now I said goodbye. It's She's such a good saver. Oh. <laughs> right now, we're drinking our champagne. <laughs> <laughs> and 
right, now we're going to bring <laughs> a Shirley girl over and Cassiope because they're going to do some taste testing. And then we're going to do some taste testing too. Can we just have a bite of ours first before we bring the doggies sure. in? Sure. Or should we bring the doggies in first? Well, let's, oh. let's, okay, let's just have one. Well, they're going to eat at the table, so. Okay. <laughs> I would like to try a salmon. I'd like a little piggy. Mmm. <laughs> Mm, mm, mm. Mm. So now, don't forget, we have to get the right plate. Shirley girl. Are, are we going to do it at the table? Shirley girl? No, we don't use, no. no, no we're going to just have a, come here Shirley. Good girl. Oh wow, Cassiope. Cassie. Your own. <laughs> I see. Oh, good. Okay, just control, baby. Oh. Okay, you can eat it. Oh my goodness. Here we go. Oh. oh, they're having a good time. A piggy. A piggy? A piggy? Okay. Oh, guys, a piggy. Okay, for Shirley. I see. You gotta be good. I see. Okay, forget the I see and just eat. It's holiday time, huh? Forget with all the obedience. Oh, that's good, huh? <laughs> okay. And now, have they had the salmon yet? No. Have they? Yes, no. no. <gasps> salmon. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yes, you can see, they love this. They really do. And, and then the, the pizza. The pizza. The pizza. Oh no, this is, oh, this is cut big. Okay, guys, don't make a mess. Oh, yes. Oh, that's good. Oh, okay, hold on. That was supposed to be for, no, no, this is for her. <laughs> As you can see, they haven't been taught manners yet. You can clean up on hers. There we go. I think they like it. I think the champagne is for us, <laughs> yeah. right? You can't give, oh, they, oh, they could go for even more. Do you want one more? Okay, which one do you prefer? I think the salmon. I think the salmon? Salmon's so good for their skin. That's true too. Mm -hmm. Omega-3. <laughs> oh, here we go. Oh. Mm. Oh, oh, I think we're ready. Okay, we have one more wiener, and then it's time for the, us girls to celebrate. There we go. Yes, you can lick my hands too. Oh, yeah. Thank you for taste testing. And once again, we say till next time. Bon appetit. Bon appetit. Bon appetit. Happy New Year.